You don't have to think fast food when you hear the phrase chicken cordon bleu, but our Katie Lee is here to show us how to create a great family dinner in just 15 minutes, maybe even less, right? Really, 15 minutes is pretty generous with mm -hmm. this one. It's my fastest, easiest, tastiest meal for dinner. All right. Perfect for a Wednesday night like tonight. That's it. And this is this is very doable, and we're going to start with some, looks like, some boneless chicken boneless, breast. Boneless, skinless chicken breast, but mm -hmm. we're going to jazz them up a bit. Yep. I've got it in a plastic baggie here. I want you to take out all your aggression and pound it real thin. Everybody needs one of these. <laughs> I mean, they really do need A meat mallet is a great tool. But, you know, if you don't have one, you can just take your skillet and bang it on there. Well, you know what? An iron skillet would yeah, work just as well. Just it might even or be a few pin. less. Yep. So you want, so you want to make this nice, nice, nice and pit, flat. And that way it's going to quit. It cook really quickly. So like we've, that. We've I mean, take serious done. minutes serious off minutes of it. Off. Yeah. Right. Okay. So what I've done, I've put each one on a little piece of parchment paper. Right. And that's going to be our tool. So Which may be the key thing in all kitchens in America. I use parchment paper For so much. Everything. It makes cleanup easy, everything. Okay, right. Harry, take a basil leaf. I got a basil leaf. Put it right on top, right. just like that. Okay. Easy so far. All right. Okay, a piece of prosciutto Ooh, on top. That's some good-looking prosciutto. So good, yeah, right? Uh -huh. Okay, it goes right on there. Yeah. Now what we're going to do, I've got my skillet nice and hot over here. Right. You're just going to take your piece yeah. of parchment paper yeah. and Smack it down. Smack like down. It's parchment so smackdown on the parchment early show. Smackdown. Here we and go. That's gonna make that prosciutto just kind of melt into the chicken. Right. And get nice and crispy. Smack yours in there. Yeah. Oh, Oops. stick it in there. You go. There. There we go. Nice. All right, that's hairy. better. All right, good job. Okay, so while that cooks, it's just gonna go about three minutes on that side. Wow. And that's it. And then okay. that's it. And it goes all the way through the prosciutto and well, through the chicken too. We'll we'll get to that. Oh, just sorry. let it have this sorry. part first. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're always I'm getting sorry. ahead of me. Harry. All right. All right. What's okay? next? Now, polenta, you think of that as something that's kind of labor intensive. Uh -huh. Traditionally, it takes about an hour to cook. Right. But we're going to use instant. Oh. So it's perfect you right. know, for a weeknight. Yep. Boil your water. Dump it in. And just dump it in. And, and what is that? And that's going to take about three minutes. Three to cook minutes. Up. So you just give it a stir, mm -hmm. and you know you can add anything you like to this. See, any I was going to say because all by itself, it's not. It is herbs, not, cheese. Yeah. Now turn that down for me. It's getting right. a little high. Right. Okay. Back there. Yeah. Very right. good. Got it. Okay. So we got to have some greens. Mm -hmm. Swiss chard is really yummy. It's mm -hmm. really healthy, and yeah, it's, it's you know, crazy look, whoa, this is going crazy this. <laughs> over here. This is getting really hot. Good. Right. Good thing, and I got one already cooked in. Anyway. Yeah, it looks good. All right. So I've heated up some oil. Yeah going to add some garlic. That I know you good. love garlic, mm -hmm. Harry. Give that a stir for me. All right, Bob. And some red pepper flakes for a little heat. I, you know what? That's another one of the Toasted key ingredients almonds. is the pepper flakes. You just keep them mm -hmm. on, just shoot them in every once in a while for yeah, whatever. Yeah, I love that. Adds a lot of flavor. Like and it a some lot. raisins. I Ooh. like raisins with greens because yeah. it takes away the bitterness to yep. have that bit of sugar. Mm -hmm. And I've chopped up my stems. You don't have to throw those out of the Swiss chard. Yeah. And you're going to let that cook for a few minutes. Yeah. And then kind of let this cook this down in. a little bit. Yeah. And then just really what you're just trying to do is get this basically warm. Yes. Right? Okay, now let's move back to our chicken. All right, move it back so to the chicken. So you get it to the point where it's done. Yeah. And you flip it over mm -hmm. just like that. Yep. Now put a piece of provolone on it. <laughs> That's where it gets really good, right? Yep. Okay, top you of the You flip there. it again? Nope. Put it on there. All right. Come on. <laughs> We're running out of time. We're running out of time. Okay, yeah. let's get it out of the oven. Over okay, here. we'll switch it out. We'll right? switch it out. I've got one in the oven that's all done. Ooh. About three minutes in the oven, just until that cheese gets nice and Look melted. At that. Delicious, right? I'm gonna plate one up for you. I mean, it doesn't get any easier than that. This you is have pretty a really easy. good yeah. gourmet dinner. All right. Look at that. Look at that. Let's get you a fork. Get me a fork and get Cut me a you taste. A bite of it. And I gotta say, if you wanna look at these recipes, <laughs> all you need to do is go to our website that is Early Show. CBSnews.com. Mm. <laughs> What's mm. the verdict? Good? Oh. I want to buy two. Too hot. Give me. A lot happens early on The Early Show. Weekday mornings on CBS.